Hey there, this is Akshit Madan and welcome back to the part 8 of complete NumPy tutorial and in this part we are going to play with the strings and the NumPy library. So if you are new on this channel, you can like my videos and subscribe to my channel and if you don't know me, you can follow me on the social media links given in the description box. So to play with the strings and NumPy, first of all, I have to define some strings, right, which I'm going to use in this uh, video. So S1 and S2 I'm defining. So S1 is Akshit is my name and S2 is I am an Indian, right? So these are the two strings S1 and S2. Now let me run this. Now S uh, np dot char dot add is the function, or you can say a uh, library, or you can say a function which you can use to concatenate these two strings, right? So S1 and S2 you can't use S1 plus S2, right? Because that is a some numeric addition. Uh, that plus sign is defined for numeric addition, right? Now this np dot char dot add is useful for concatenating your strings. So let me run it, and you can see the output. Both the strings are concatenated, right? Now this np dot char dot upper is going to convert all your characters in this string to uppercase. So let me run it. As you can see, all the characters in S1 string are converted into uppercase. Now same thing this lower will do. So all these things are self-explanatory, right? Their words only define what their function is. So this is going to convert all the characters in lowercase. Now np dot char dot split is something that is useful and and thus uh, the further things that I'm going to use they are a little bit interesting and useful. Now np dot char dot split is going to split my string at the places where it is going to find an uh, uh, space. Right, so if I run it, you can see I'm getting a list of the elements. Akshit is my name. So where uh, the place where it is finding a space in the string, it is going to split it, and it, all the elements will be added in a list. Right now, this np dot split lines, it is going to split the uh, string at the place where it is going to find a new line character or where you are changing the line. So if I'm going to run it. You can see Akshit is my is uh, one element and name is another element. Why? Because there is a backslash n coming between these two elements. So this is the advantage of this split line function. Now, what does this np dot char dot replace do? So it is go inside. It will go inside this first parameter that is s1 string, and it is going to replace this name with this surname, right? So it is going to replace this first uh, string with this second string, which you have defined. So if I run this, you can see Akshit is my surname now. Why? Because name is replaced by surname. Perfect. Now here you can see I am printing goodbye, but I am not saying goodbye to you. I am saying that you can uh, print this uh, stars and this goodbye pattern using this np dot char dot center function, right? So if I run this, you can see I am getting this goodbye, but this can be very much uh, helpful uh, using this. You can it can be very much easier using this, right? What do you have to do? Np dot char dot center. It means that it is going to print this goodbye in the center and all the other places that is 80 places it, it is going to totally consume and all the rest of the places will be covered by this star. So if I run this you can see all the rest of the places are covered by star. So you don't have to print star 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 you can use this function and you can print this pattern. Okay so I think we are almost we are we have ended this numpy tutorial series and if something comes up uh, new and interesting, I'm going to append in this playlist. But I think this much is enough for this playlist. And I hope you have enjoyed this play playlist. And if you have any doubts, you can reach out to me on my Telegram channel. Yes, so till the next content, keep coding, keep innovating and thanks a lot.